Good morning, Tigers. I hope you had a great weekend. I'm Jared Joseph here with your Tiger TV Sports Minute. If you haven't already heard, history was made on the hardwood Saturday afternoon. LSU's Tim Quarterman did what no other Tiger has done besides the big diesel Shaquille O'Neal back in 92 and notched a triple-double. Quarterman got 18 points, 10 rebounds, and 10 assists, which led the Tigers to a 73-63 win against the Ole Miss Rebels. The sophomore guard joins the elite Tiger class. Besides Shaq, the only other LSU player to get a triple-double was Pistol Pete Maravich. The Tigers' next game is Wednesday night at 6 when they host Tennessee for their last home game of the season. Speaking of history, it was also a historic weekend for men's tennis coach Jeff Brown. With Saturday's victory against Kentucky, Brown broke former coach Jerry Simmons' record for most wins in the university's history. Brown's 279th victory was part of LSU's sweep of both Tennessee and Kentucky. Their next game is Friday at South Carolina. And it was a successful weekend series for LSU baseball when the Purple and Gold hosted Princeton's season opener. In a battle of the Tigers versus the Tigers, LSU struggled to begin the series Friday night, but won the game 3-2. However, the Tigers did get better as the weekend continued LSU's margin of victory increase. The Purple and Gold won both games on, sat on Saturday's doubleheader with 7-2 and 15-4 wins, respectively. LSU swept Princeton for the series and will have their next game tomorrow night at 6.30 when Stephen F. Austin comes to Alex Box Stadium. Well, guys, that's all the time we have for today. Make sure to follow us on Twitter and Instagram at, w at TTV underscore sports. And check out our website, www.tigertv.tv, for up-to-date LSU news. We'll see you tomorrow.